Edward Primary School is located in a poverty-stricken area, beset with high levels of unemployment. It would not be uncommon for some learners to go without the basic needs. Personally, I've spent three years of my life without school shoes at school, and I miss a lot of school. I know how is it like uh, uh, kids uh, not to go to school, they get embarrassed, they get ridiculed by other kids, and they have excuses of not going to school just because of their school shoes. They will say, you know, I'm sick, I've got a headache, I've got this and that. Whereas deep down, it's because of their shoes. So we're trying to restore that dignity, helping uh, that uh, uh, girl child and a boy child to go to school. The campaign also aims to raise funds for 40 mobile classrooms, toilets and transport for rural areas. We took uh, Edward Primary in our, in our wings. That was uh, since 2011. We're supplying them various items, being identified as a school in need. And uh, we took hold of the school. And today we're uh, distributing uh, school shoes to, to all the kids in the school. Cassie Angel says with this handover of over 400 pairs, it's now reached a milestone of 42,000 donated across the country. But it wants to reach that magical million mark in a bid to restore the dignity of the country's learners, one pair of school shoes at a time. Vanessa Puna, SABC News, Alsace River.